Hi, we're gonna assemble our pasoli now. We've got the spices ready to go. We've got uh, pork here, traditionally is used in pasoli, along with the red chili and the hominy. A braised pork cubes, about two pounds of that. We're gonna use uh, one large onion and about six cloves of garlic. We're gonna mix that together. Another ingredient that's in pasoli is uh, cinnamon. Spanish, uh, in Spanish, it's canela. And um, let's go ahead and put all that together. Let's go over to the stove and saute our onions and garlic. Okay, we're gonna have to, we use the oil, the juices from the pork, from the meat, to saute our onions. Let the onions get a little bit soft before you just dump the garlic in there. Don't just make a big pile and a big mess. You wanna coat these in a little bit. Let them soften up. Oh, we'll go ahead and add our garlic to it. Mm -mm. I love garlic. And I hope you do too. So, we'll saute this for about two to three minutes. We'll go ahead and add the meat back to it. We'll let this mix up a little bit. Okay, and there you are. We have a nice mixture of the meat, the garlic, the onions. Next thing we're going to do, we're going to put it in the pot, start to add the spices, some beef broth, chili, let it simmer for a bit. So, we'll be right back. Hi, welcome back. It's time to put our pozole together, let it simmer for a bit. Transfer the pork, onions, garlic to our big stew pot. We'll let it get nice and hot, make sure it's going there. It just looks great in there. Now, we add our toasted spices. It smells so good. Just wait till it mixes in here. I'm gonna add our chili pepper. This is our dry chili. Now, I put a bit of hot in here. What I was thinking is gonna be about right. Now being from Texas, I can prefer a good bit of hot, but again, you guys be careful. Okay, and there it goes. It just turned everything bright red. Now, we're gonna put our pasole hominy in there. And our broth. Now I've got some beef broth here, it's homemade. And just like I do chicken broth, make the beef broth. Check uh, kungfucafe.com for a nice recipe of beef broth. Now we're gonna stir this together. Everything's mixed well. I'm gonna put the lid on. Check our flame. We're gonna let it simmer for about an hour. See you then.